What's up, y'all? Final score, 31-21. Hey, Josh Norman, I got, a, I got a question for you. Are you impressed now? Were you not entertained? Were you not entertained? <laughs> Man, we were tagging Josh Norman hard. That's what you get when you talk shit. Next time, maybe you should shut your fucking mouth. I'm not impressed. Dak doesn't impress me. You better be impressed today, motherfucker. Because he was all over your ass today. Man. Uh, Zeke had over 100 yards. Dak balled out. Man. That 42-yard run by Dak. Holy shit, man. Whew, Michael Gallup. Man, Michael Gallup is really like, he's starting to come along. I'm telling you. Michael Gallup, mm, he's looking better and better each week. I'm telling you. Um, defense, for the most part, did their job. They, they were okay. The defense has been a little shaky as of late. Last week, they were shaky. The la uh, in the playoffs against the Rams, they were shaky. They've been a little shaky, so I don't know what's going on. But to be honest, I, I, I know what's going on. The defensive line, the defensive line can get pushed around at times, uh, the, especially the interior. We really need some interior uh, defensive line help uh, because that's our Achilles heel in the defense. Uh, safety, of course, is the glaring weak spot. But, like, that interior, like, it, the middle, oh, it... I love Antoine Woods, but he's not cutting it, and he got hurt today. So we really the the um, the rookie Tristan Hill. I think he's still hurt, but um, yeah, we really need to beef up that interior defensive line because that's one of our weak spots. But overall, the game was fucking uh, great. Oh, <sighs> it, it just you know you just see a couple of spots here and there that kind of like kind of dampens the win because like I mean. You don't have to fire on all cylinders at the beginning of the season. You don't have to. But you still see some glaring weaknesses that you want to, like, iron out, you know, towards the middle and the end of the season. And especially when you go against the tougher competition like the Bears, the Saints, the Patriots, stuff like that, the Rams, you're going to have to iron out those, like, weak spots. So that's why I'm not too, too, too excited because I'm like, uh, you can still see some things. That can be ironed out, and you just you just hope that they get ironed out throughout the season. Uh, but uh, my Cowboys start they started the season two and zero uh, over the last twenty three seasons. Whenever the Cowboys start two and zero, the last that whenever they start two and zero, they make it to the playoffs. So at the last twenty three seasons, they started out two and zero. Twenty of those times, they went to the playoffs. So that's a great sign for us next week. We got the Dolphins. That's another win. Uh, well, it should be another win. I don't take any team for granted. Uh, you never know. The Dolphins may come to play. So, But that should be a W. And then after that, that's when the schedule starts to ramp up. We play the Saints. So we got two division wins. Um, that's great. Um, team is looking solid. Um, coaching is pretty solid. You know, everything is looking good. And like I said, you guys, you're going to have those folks that say, well, it was just the Redskins. No, you took out two divisional foes. You took out the Giants and you took out the Redskins. And I don't care what the record says. I don't care what they're projected to be. They will always fight the Cowboys the hardest. They will always fight us harder. So these wins mean something. And it's not just the Redskins. It's not just the Giants. And uh, those Eagle fans out there that like to say, oh, it was just the Redskins. We weren't down 17 to, 17 to 0 in halftime like you. So you can't afford to say shit. It was just the Redskins. Those, it was just the Redskins were whooping your ass last week. That's all I'm saying. But you guys, uh, great win. We're 2-0. Uh, the way everything is looking, we, could, we should be able to make the playoffs. But this season is long. 14 games left. We got a lot of opponents, especially tough opponents. You never know. So everything's looking good right now. I don't want to jinx us, but things are looking up. All right, you guys, follow your boy on Instagram, Gerard John1991. That's J A R R O D J O H N 1991. I'm going to catch you guys later. Peace.